The minister said the two patients are spouses of those that had primary contacts with Sawyer, adding that they are among the secondary contacts that have been under surveillance. According to the minister, this now brings the total number of Ebola patients currently under treatment at the isolation ward to four and the total number of cases of the Ebola virus cases so far reported in the country to 14. Professor Chuku noted that five people have died of the viral disease in Nigeria, while the number of those successfully managed and discharged also stands at five. The Ebola virus disease doesn't mean it's a death sentence. It is not a death sentence. People survive the Ebola virus disease. When you are not sick, you cannot transfer it to anybody. You only start infecting others the moment you become sick. The battle is not over, but I know the country has done well in containing it. There's no doubt. In the meantime, the minister also met with the leadership of the Association of General Private Medical Practitioners of Nigeria and the Guild Doctors, where he lauded their appreciation for standing with government in this crucial time. He condoled them over the death of Dr. Amiyu Adedadu. He said the federal government is working with the legal state government and other partners to maintain vigilance and strengthen containment activities. Patience. Oh, Saul Gua reporting.